Hello, let's get the energy level up together. Get the heart beating. We're gonna do some interval training type yoga and it's gonna be higher intensity. It's maybe about 17 minutes. I don't remember exactly, uh, but it does go by pretty quick. And step by step, when I, we go through the poses, I try and let you know what the next one's gonna be. And it's a lot of fun, so join me. Hey guys, so this is a faster paced class. We're gonna do one minute uh, intervals of the movements that we're gonna be doing that are yoga minded. I hope that makes some sense. So stick with it, see how you do, and let it feel good. I'm gonna time us for one minute for each little thing that we do. So make your way to the front of your mat. Inhale the arms up towards the sky. Exhale, bow forward. Bring your hands to the floor or your shin bones. We're gonna bend the knees. We're gonna step or jump into a downward dog. We're gonna breathe, bend the knees, look forward, pounce to the front of your mat or step there. Reverse your swan dive, come on up with the arms reaching up towards the sky. Breathe in, exhale, bow forward, <sighs> knees bend, plant with the hands, step or jump, downward dog, pounce forward, reverse swan dive and come on up to standing. Take a deep breath. Bow forward, knees bend, downward dog, pounce forward, reverse swan dive, and come on up. Let's do a couple more, maybe just one if we have time. Downward dog, pounce forward, reverse swan dive, and come on up. Bring your hands into prayer, and lower down in front of your heart. Very nice. Inhale here. Step that right leg back. Open up to a warrior two position. Roll the shoulders up and back. Breathe deeply. Step that right foot forward. The arms come up. The left leg steps back. We open up to warrior two. The left leg steps forward. We reach the arms up. Right leg back. Open warrior two. Right leg forward. Arms up. Beautiful. Left leg back. Warrior two, step forward, arms up. Let's do a couple more. Right leg back, arms out, warrior two, beautiful. Step forward, arms come up, good. Left leg back, open up, and step forward. Breathing in, right leg back, open up. Right leg forward, <sighs> beautiful. Left arm back, open up. Left arm forward, and we stand with the arms up. Good. Bring your hands down into prayer, lower down in front of your heart. Good. Take a deep breath in. Let go of a sigh. <sighs> Feel the heart pumping. Good. So take your left knee up in front of you. Float the arms out to a T. Good. Lower the arms, lower the knee. Float the arms out, the, left, the right knee comes up. Good, lower down, and let's do the other side. We're just gonna keep going. One side, and then the other. Good. Breathe and feel. This is your crane pose. Getting the body moving today. One leg and then the other. Moving for the minute. Minute to move. Use your breath. The next thing we do is going to be downward dog into upward dog. So you can have your knees down for the upward dog part or not. Keep breathing. Building up some arm muscle here and upper thigh muscle. Good. Bring the legs down, arms down, and shake out your shoulders. Good. Take a deep breath in. Good, make your way into downward dog. So from downward dog, we move the hips forward and down into an upward dog. 
We come back into downward dog. And up for dog. Hips forward and down. So if you want, the knees can come down for upward dog and the hips come back while the knees are down. This is puppy dog into upward dog, okay? Or you do your downward dog into your upward dog. Keep going. Keep breathing. We're gonna work on some side planks next. Feel good. Jaw is relaxed. Breath is deep. Moving the body. Good, lower your knees to the floor. Take a moment to sit back to the heels and bow your body forward and down, just rest. Feel the back body expanding. Jaw relaxed. Good, bring the body forward and you're gonna prepare for your side planks. So the hands are underneath the shoulders, fingers are spread wide and I want to use my fingertips to grip my mat. So I'm going to grip my mat and squeeze backward. So what we're going to do is go from one side plank to the next. So come into your plank. You're going to roll to the right side of your feet and take your left arm up. Bring the left arm down, roll to the left side of your feet and lift the right arm up. And let's just keep doing that side to side. Roll and lift. Good. <sighs> Breathing. Feel your jaw relax. And the next thing we're gonna do is some <sighs> reverse tables. helping to build the strength in the arms. Lower down with that arm, lower the knees to the floor, and give yourself a moment. We're gonna sit back to the heels, lift the body tall. Take a deep breath in. Feel the heart beating. Good. Bring your weight to one side, the feet out in front. I hope you're having a great time. Good. So your hands are behind you. Fingers point in. Feet are planted. We inhale. And then exhale, lift the hips up. Reverse table. Lower the hips to hover and lift back up. Keep going. Lower, hover, lift back up. Lower, hover, lift back up. Keep going. Good. Next thing we're gonna do after this is bridge pose with the legs alternating, being lifted towards the sky. Keep focusing on this while we're doing it. See the elbows are bending every time the hips come down. That's those triceps working. Keep breathing. Lower the hips. Good. Extend your legs long. Lift your body forward. Shake out your wrists. Bring your hands to your thighs. Shake out your shoulders. Good. Make your way to your back for bridge posture. Shoulder blades tuck underneath the back. Jaw relaxing. Lift those hips up. Interlace the fingers underneath the body. Rock so that your shoulder blades tuck under. And the hips are lifting really high. We're gonna take the right leg up, lower it down. The left leg up, lower it down. Keep going, right leg and down. Left leg and down, beautiful. Right leg and down, left leg. Keep going. 
You got this. The next thing we're going to do after this is leg lifts. Keep breathing, one leg and then the other. Good. Plant the foot, lift the hips, take a deep breath, release arms, and lower the hips. Good. Untuck your, to your, <laughs> your toes, your shoulders and a little rocking for the knees side to side. Good. It's good to take a little, a little tiny 10 second break in between. Good. So your hands are gonna come underneath your bottom and we're gonna lift the legs straight up off the ground. Lower and lift when you're ready towards the ground and back up. If this is too easy, bring the arms alongside instead. Let your jaw relax. Building up some heat in the body. And after this, we're gonna do our side boat leg lifts. Lower the legs, untuck the hands, take a deep breath in, bend the knees. Roll yourself over to the left side to prepare yourself. Left forearm underneath, elbow under shoulder. The legs go long. So give yourself just a second here. Keep breathing. Let your face relax. You are doing so great. Take your right leg when you're ready and lift it up and lower it down. Good. Lift up and now take your left leg up as well. Take the right arm up. Lower left leg, lower right leg, lower arm. Lift right leg, lift left leg, lift right arm. Lower, lower, lower. Good, let's do that again. Keep going. Now you've got it, you know what to do, and you can do it, do it, do it. Keep breathing. Lift, lift, lift. Lower, lower, lower. What goes up must come down. As you lift up, make sure you're trying to lift out of this left arm as well. Lift, lift, lift. Lower, lower, lower. I'm building up some heat. I don't know about you guys. Lift, lift, lift. Lower, lower, lower. Good. Keep going. <sighs> Feeling good. The other side of the body is waiting. I can't wait for you to do this. Leg, leg, arm. Lower, lower, lower. Good. Beautiful, good, lower it down. Take a moment to breathe. Let's bend the knees and come over to the opposite side. Extending through the legs. Lift your left leg up, just take a moment, breathe in. Now lower it down, good. Now you're gonna take that leg up, lift the right leg, lift the left arm, good. Legs come down and the arm, good. Lift, lift, lift. Beautiful. Lower, lower, lower. Lift, lift, lift. Lower, lower, lower. Keep going. Beautiful. Good. Breathing. Feeling good. Getting weightless on this right arm as you lift. Beautiful. Lift, lift, lift. 
Lower, lower, lower. Good. Good. How do you feel as you get through these? Right, it's just a minute each. You can do it. Let's do our pigeon next and that'll be our, our final movement. Good. Perfect, 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 perfect. Roll onto your belly. Let's take a deep breath in. Push our way up to table. Good. So moving into pigeon. Here we go. So let's bring the right knee forward. Extend the left leg long. Lower down to rest this pigeon. Lift up to strengthen the back. Curl the back toes, lift, switch, legs. Lower down to rest the pigeon. Lift up to strengthen the back. Beautiful. Back toes curl, switch legs. Lower down to rest the pigeon. Lift up to strengthen the back. Curl back toes, switch. Down to rest, up to strengthen. Beautiful. Keep going. Good. The next time your legs are back, lower the knees down to the floor, open wide with the knees, let the big toes touch, and let's sit back into a child's pose. The arms come forward. Always a great way to finish a session. Rest your head. Feel your heart beating. Lift your head, walk your hands back. A great way to compliment this little video is to do another one. <laughs> so check out what other videos we have hanging around and I hope you have an amazing rest of the day or night. Check out carryyoga.com for more. You can join us for live classes as well and we'll see you soon. Namaste.